I'm Vandalier, and I'm so glad you're here. We did a little IRL stream earlier today. I was at Yumacon. I had a very exciting day today. I met the voice actors of Aerith, Tifa, Yuffie, and Barrett. I have a little poster sign to show you guys. But yeah, we wandered around Yumacon for a little bit today as well. And I brought you guys along and that was really fun. I had a great time. Honestly, I'm like stunned right now. I can't believe I just had the day that I had. I am legitimately just like, my head is spinning. So I, I went to Britt Baron first, who voices Tifa and I was like so excited, happy in line and like, oh, I can't believe we're here. And I'm looking at them all at the tables and I get up and I go to talk to her and almost immediately I started crying because <laughs> I was like, I started telling her I didn't know what I was going to say to them. I had nothing in mind. I was just like, I'm going to get up there and whatever we talk about is what we talk about. And I had nothing I wanted to say. So I got up first one. Tifa sitting in front of me and I start to tell her how I just had my one year stream anniversary, affiliate stream anniversary and just quit my full like my day job and I'm streaming full time now and my first game I ever streamed was FF7 remake and as I'm saying this like all of the emotion starts welling up of what that all means like how much I'm going to do it again. How much my life has changed in a year that I had no idea. I did not see it coming. I went into streaming on kind of a whim and was like, this looks fun. I should try this and see what it's like. And then I started doing it and I love it so much. Um, and obviously here we are now still making progress, still making baby steps and getting, you know, Every little step of the way, we're growing and learning how this all works and how we work together and all of that. But uh, but yeah, so as I'm saying this out loud to Tifa, who was like my first favorite character, you know, um, and just like all of the memories start flooding back of like how far we've come. And I think it just all hit me at once as I was standing there. So here I am again. This is exactly what happened as I was talking to her. It was just like, this means so much to me. It's not just a game. It's not just, you know, I don't know. People have all their ideas about gaming. Obviously, Britt Barron's not going to be somebody who needs to be told this. But I feel like any of us in our in our work, anything that we're passionate about, it's good to hear and to be reaffirmed that what you do matters on like a deeper level. So I just started to tell her that that was, that was why it means so much to me to like be there and like get to just let them know how much their work has meant to us, to me specifically, but to all of us and how far it has brought us. So that's how I started my day. <laughs> I feel like I got the most of my like, emotional overwhelm out first with Britt Baron. Um, and she was so sweet and like took took the time to like talk with me and then we took some photos and then we took silly photos and um, yeah, she was really sweet. So I appreciated that she was, <laughs> seemed totally like in tune with the fact that I was having big emotions, but they were happy, positive emotions and, you know, didn't make her uncomfortable or anything. And then kind of same similar thing when I went and talked to Brianna White, um, Aerith, just started to let her know that a lot of you guys found me because of her channel. Like my page, my, my channel was recommended to you on YouTube because uh, you had watched Brianna's channel. Yeah, so I started to tell her that. She thought that was really cool, too. Um, she even <laughs> took a picture of when she signed her, my, you know, the poster. She signed it, and I, you know, I told her, Vandalier, told her how to spell it. She took a picture of my name, and she said, I'm going to go follow you later. And I was like, what? <laughs> That's insane, but okay. Thank you. Um, you know what's funny is you probably were recommended to me as well because of Brianna Streams, too. I think, I think a lot of people, that's why I was like, this is actually really incredible that so many of you have found me through her and I had to share that with her. I was like, it was really cool that I got to tell her what that has meant to me.
if she randomly showed up here with the gang of VAs, can you imagine? Can you imagine? Like, just the fact that she offered to like fo like follow the channel, like, was totally unnecessary. But was just like, what? really? <laughs> I think she said follow on Twitch, but I don't know. Like, we'll see what happens. Um. She liked my post on Twitter of our picture together. And uh, that was really exciting, too. <laughs> like, she she thought it. She liked it. Yay. <laughs> uh, I met Strange Rebel. Yes, I did. And she was amazing. I legit was smiling ear to ear seeing all of those pics you took <laughs> with the VAs to meet the actors behind your inspiration to become a streamer. And now have such a great community group of vandals. Yes. And like... This is only a thing because you guys are here. Like, it's not it, like this doesn't exist without all of you. So, like, I hope you know how much you all mean to me being here, showing up, being amazing. Here I go again. <laughs> Feeling all of the emotions. It was a really good day. So I'll show you. Actually, I'll just show you now. But so here it is. This is the print I decided to go with the like straight up game graphics of all of the characters and so we've got Susie Young there to the end of year, Yuffie and then we've got let me see if I can do this without looking Brianna White to Vandalier stay strong and carry on love Aerith and then we've got Let's see, can I get to Tifa without overshooting? There's Tifa. She put the Vandalier, we'll meet again. Love Tifa. And then we've got Barrett. And he was going to put, he said he didn't have enough room in that corner to put, um, Vandalier. So he's like, can I just call you Lady V? And I said, use Van instead. That's what they call me. So much love, Van. Jay Bentley. Barrett. And so now I just need to get Cloud and Red 13. And this will be a perfect memento of our first year of streaming. And too many more. One incredible encounter after another. Then I met Susie Young, who voices Yuffie, and I didn't cry with her. We, I, I, I bounced up to the table and I said, I'm so, so bored. Bored right out of my mind. So that conversation, we started with giggles and laughter and just joy over, you know, shared love of what these characters have meant to us. And then... Lastly, I went to John Bentley, who voices Barrett, and he is just, I mean, I've heard, I've heard stories that he's such an amazing person, but standing in line and watching how much care and um, consideration he gave to every single person who was there, um, and he's joking and making everybody laugh, and then one second later, he's being super heartfelt, and he started crying, and then he got me crying. I am getting all worked up again. I'm like literally hot. I'm taking off my Mr. Rogers cardigan right now. Um, and while I was waiting in line, he was doing like videos with people. Like that's one of the things you can ask for is to like have a little short video of him saying something, doing something. And one of them, he got on the video and he and the other, the person who was like requesting they did the da, 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 da. so that reminded me i was like oh my god i have to show him the intro to my my edited youtube videos that is my intro song is him doing that not just the victory song but him doing that song so i pulled up one of the most recent one where i did the my top 10 moments from uh, FF7 Rebirth and the intro to that has Vandalier pops up with the little pretty flourish says Vandalier and it's Barrett going da, 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 da. <laughs> so I showed him that he laughed and then my video starts to play and he like looked he like saw me pop up on the video and he goes oh is that Brit like 
Britt Barron, who was sitting right next to us. And and then he goes, no, is that you? And I was like, yeah, that's me. That's my video. I was like, started. And so he pulls the phone up and he starts listening and he hears me talking on the video. And he goes, wow, you got a really great voice. You could definitely do voice acting. Like, pulls my video so he can listen to my voice because he it started to hear it play and was like wow so that was a really cool moment oh he pulls over another guy walks over and he goes you know who this is and he tells me his name and i was like no but tell me who he is and he goes this is the director for final fantasy rebirth this is the guy that directed all of us i was like Hi, I'm Vandalier. If you ever need a new voice actor. <laughs> I, did, I was so silly, but they were very, very cool. <laughs> like, what are the chances? We're standing here and I'm like, have this in my mind. I want to do voice acting. And then he's like, oh, by the way, this is the director who directed our acting. <laughs> this is life. This is my life. I tell you, it's just going to it's just going to keep going like this. The more I say it, the more it's true, too. <laughs> it's the ADHD way of life, though. I go, I see something, and I'm like, ooh, that looks interesting. I'll try that. And then, like, it snowballs from there. And I've tried to tell myself often in life, I am exactly where I need to be, even when things are crazy or hard or weird or complicated, but especially when things are good. <laughs> I'm always like, you are exactly where you need to be. Every little step, every little thing is putting you where you need to be. You know, a year and a half ago, I had no idea that this is what I would be doing. And then I saw what it was and I realized how much it resonated with me to be a streamer means to embody all of the things that I love doing and all of the things that I feel are like my skill sets. Um, and of course, there's room to grow too, which is also really appealing to me because it means there's there's new things for me to learn. <laughs> um, but yeah, so now that I've got this like thought in my head, I would love to do voice acting because I started dabbling with it, playing these games. And I'm like, oh, this is actually really like satisfying to do. Now it's in my head and I'm like, well, now I'm just going to do it. Like, <laughs> there's no, I just, I'm going to do it, you know? It's been a day, man. Da 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 da